What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Matt here from Matt's Great World, and I am back today with another video. And today, I'm going to be reacting to a couple of songs that were requested by a subscriber. Uh, first, we're going to be listening to Comfortably Numb by Pink Floyd. And we're also going to be listening to Side of a Bullet by Nickelback. Uh, so, this is my first video where I'm doing two songs in one video. And you're probably wondering why I'm listening to Pink Floyd and Nickelback in the same video. Again, it's because a subscriber requested it. I was initially going to do them in their own separate videos. But I've been procrastinating on those videos a lot lately. So, I just decided... Why not just get it out of the way and do them both in one video? Saves a lot of time and energy. Now that I've got all of that out of the way, let's get right into the reaction. All right, here's Pink Floyd's Comfortably Numb. The video is made by Pro Lyric Guy, so go check him out and check out his channel. Uh, none of this is owned by me at all. I uh, just wanted to say that right up front before we began, so let's get started. I just I just wanted to stop it in, right here and say that it's got a very slow, melodic, almost psychedelic type um, sound to it, and it's it's just very I don't know it's it's in it's interesting. Interesting. That's an interesting metaphor right there. I didn't. A distance smoke. A uh, distance ship smoke on the horizon. That's that's interesting. I never heard never heard that one before. Again, that's another interesting metaphor that just kind of makes you think. The lyrics are just so thought-provoking, and they're definitely telling a story, for sure. What feeling? Hmm. The guitar work in this is just absolutely extraordinary. It's just, I just love it. Especially this little solo this early in the song. It's awesome.
again, it's just very psychedelic here in the verses, and it's also definitely telling a story, though I don't understand exactly what the story is. It's just maybe, maybe it's about just kind of being comfortable in your own skin, I guess, is a good way to put it. Ship smoke on the horizon. There it is. There, there it is again. That metaphor. Uh, a distance ship smoke on the horizon. It's just I don't know, but that line is just very, very interesting. Of what? yet again the guitar work is just amazing in this track <laughs> pro lyric guy you certainly did a number on this a few, all those years ago back in what 2010 I mean, it's not the heaviest solo in the world, but it, it's it's a good solo. It's really, really good. It, you can really tell that they're shredding out. It's really, really good. And that is Comfortably Numb by Pink Floyd. Here's Nickelback's Side of a Bullet. This video was made by, uh, and I'm sorry if I'm saying the guy's name wrong, but David Kamhai. Uh, let me know if I said that wrong in the comments down below. Uh, so here we go. Definitely got a heavier intro this time around. I believe this is from their Silver Side Up days. Oh yeah. So that so that whole first verse and chorus definitely kind of 
uh, hit hit things pretty hard. Uh, I believe uh, the person who the person who requested this Joe Rosso, he said uh, that this song was about the death of one of the Abbott brothers from Pantera. So, and they certainly made that very apparent in the lyrics as well. And it's just got a lot of angst and it's got a lot of, it's, it's definitely got a, it's a very heavy track. It's definitely, I'm definitely getting a lot of grunge, uh, from this, from this track, but it's pretty good so far. Let's see what the rest holds. Man, this guitar just sounds awesome. Okay, here we go. Yep. Shred it, baby. Shred it. Oh, yeah. This guitar is amazing. Oh, yeah, just sing it. Sing it, Chad, baby. Let's go. That's awesome. Both of these songs had very impactful and very important messages and stories to tell. And they both hit very heavy in their own way. And they both contrasted each other so much, but they also shared so much in common. It's ridiculous. So let's start off with Comfortably Numb, right? It's kind of got a slower, more ambient, more psychedelic sound to it, right? And it kind of just talked about, you know, just being at home in your own skin and being um, just okay with who you are in the moment. And it had some great guitar work as well. The drums definitely added to the softer, more ambient sound of the song overall. But, oh boy, there was so much going on with Side of a Bullet by Nickelback, okay? This song was heavy, it was angsty, it was just full of rage start to finish. The guitar was, was just so fantastic and they certainly got straight to the point with talking about just the anger of, you know, watching one of the biggest rock stars in the world get taken down by someone with a gun. Like, it's just, I don't know every, all the things that happened surrounding the Abbott Brothers or Pantera, um, but it's just, I can tell that Nickelback was heavily affected by that, and it's certainly shown through on that song. And it's just the guitars are pounding and at your throat at all times. The drums, it's a metal song, okay? You go from psychedelic Pink Floyd to heavy metal Nickelback. So definitely very different. Uh, very two songs that are very, very different from each other. But they are very, very impactful and very heavy, like I said. So... What did you all think about these two songs? Let me know down in the comments below. Leave a like on this video. Share it with your friends and colleagues. Spread the new, 
spread the word about this awesome channel that we got here uh, over at Matt's Great World. Lastly, if you like this video enough, how about you go ahead and subscribe to the channel. We put up great content like this all the time. Uh, I'm going to stop rambling now. So thank you guys so, so much. As always, stay safe, stay warm, stay happy. And as, never, and as always, it's never goodbye. It's just till next time. All right, guys, I'll see you all on Wednesday.